गुड मॉर्निंग गाइज दिस इज पुष्पक राज एंड टूडेज टॉपिक इज ऑन वॉट इज द डिफरेंस बिटवीन द बाउंड्री वैल्यू एनालिसिस एंड इक्वेल एंड क्लास पार्टिशनिंग और वॉट इज द बाउंड्री वैल्यू एनालिसिस एंड इक्वेल एंड क्लास पार्टिशनिंग गाइज दिस इज द इम्पॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन इन द इंटरव्यू प्रोस्पेक्टिव ऑल्सो आई हैव क्रिएट अ मल्टीपल वीडियोज ऑन टेस्ट केस टेम्पलेट्स और ऑटोमेशन टेस्टिंग और मैनुअल टेस्टिंग इन दिस चैनल सो प्लीज सब्सक्राइब द चैनल हिट द बेल आइकॉन थैंक यू ओके सो टूडेज टॉपिक इज वॉट इज द बाउंड्री वैल्यू एनालिसिस एंड इक्वेल एंड क्लास पार्टिशनिंग सो फर्स्ट वन इज द what is the boundary value analysis boundary value analysis is a software testing technique is used to identify the test the boundaries or limit of the input values it is focuses on testing the minimum and maximum boundary value of the given input range i will give a simple example guys so it will easy to understand suppose there is a text field of any application that is the password text field okay so the size of that text field which will be minimum size which accept 8 character and maximum size which will be accept 15 character space is not allowed and special character is not allowed so we are performing the testing on that that is the boundary value analysis testing that is what we do we are performing minimum minus 1 minimum plus 1 maximum minus 1 maximum plus 1 okay space is not allowed special character is not allowed in that way you can create a format okay in the minimum minus 1 means minimum we are till i am told to, told you guys minimum is 8 okay so 8 plus 1 9 means it is in between 8 to 15 character means that is the valid condition because it is a 9 maximum plus 1 maximum what is the maximum value it is a 15 15 plus 1 means 16 it is more than it is not in between 8 to 15 means it is a invalid value maximum minus 1 maximum what is the maximum value that is a 15 minus 1 means 14 it is in between 8 to 15 means it is a valid space is not allowed invalid special character is not allowed means invalid means in that password text field in that way you are performing the boundary value analysis guys and next one is the equivalent class partitioning so what is the equivalent class partitioning equivalent class partitioning is a software testing technique in which input data is divided into partition of valid or invalid values and it is a mandatory that all the partitions must be exhibited same behavior in simple way guys there is a mobile number text field in any application which will be accept only 10 digit in that case when, what kind of testing or how to perform testing in that text field like invalid test minus 1 means digit 10 less than 10 means we are enter the less than 10 digit or check that the test case is pass or fail means that will accept or not so in that case what what we do i have enter a 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 8 digit i have enter so in that case i have getting the invalid because it will only accept the 10 digit in the second test case how i perform i have enter 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 11 means more than 10 means in that case also we are getting the invalid result in that case i am exactly enter the 10 digit in that case i am getting the valid result in that case i am entering the valid 10 digit or exact 10 digit in that case i am getting the valid uh, result means equivalent class partitioning which will what you tell all the partition must be exhibit exhibit the same behavior okay guys i think you guys are got it thank you guys for watching the videos please hit the bell icon subscribe the video for more videos regarding the automation testing manual testing python java i will cover all of this in this channel also i am creating the short videos mcq videos which will be recall you fast thank you guys have a good day